Jack. It's Warrington. I just got your message, and uh, uh, indeed, sad, sad, sad. I, uh, oh, oh boy. Uh, my favorite uh, phone correspondent, uh, uh, Jack, was. Uh, as you know, he, uh, uh, he was full of ideas full of a lot of stuff, and uh, uh, I will certainly miss uh, having him as a, my California correspondent. Uh, you know, I've known this guy uh, all my life, and uh, as you know, it's been a pretty long one, and uh, I, uh, I think we must be about the same age, and uh, uh, we had many adventures here and there, uh, um, many memories, and I, uh, I certainly appreciate your call. And uh, if there's a memorial service of some kind, uh, I would appreciate uh, being on the, the, the list, although there is no way I can get out to California and do this uh, properly, so uh, I'll have to take a rain check, but uh, I will, I'll plan a, a California trip uh, as as soon as I can, and, and uh, I'll discuss it with you, and uh, uh, see if we can I can get out there, and we can drink a few martinis, and uh, remember a fine man, a fine man, uh, and. Uh, I, uh, if, if, uh, you know, if it's possible to buy one of his paintings, I would love to do that. I would love to have one of his paintings hanging in my house. And, uh, uh, so, uh, if, if you, if you know of, uh, way to do that uh let me know let me know um so uh, uh very sad it's, it's very sad uh, but you know he lived a full life and to the hilt to the hilt uh and uh it's just memories of him flood back to me and it it covers uh it seems to me it must cover about uh, uh 90 years or so and uh okay well i uh, i join you in your, your feelings at this moment.